here we are back in the listing loft it is kind of hard to see a little dark in here it's january 4th wednesday 2023 just wanted to show you uh some of the late night work i've been doing this you're watching the happy vintage loft pretty sweet Bachman Railway Express Agency coach up on the site. As you can see there, it's got uh, internal illumination that's provided by little nine volt battery. And we'll get some light on this guy and see what he looks like. So yeah, I'm just shooting this guy in a little photo. I'm just shooting this guy in a little photo stage I set up in the garage. I've got some uh, seamless running behind. I've got two diffused lights on the left and right. And then I've got this kind of goofy um, ring light in front. You know, this could just as easily be another diffused light like these guys but this just happens to be what I have. I got this to hopefully improve some of my clothing photography, but we'll see, we'll see, see about that. Anyhow, let's take a closer look at this guy. Got some really nice detailing on this. I particularly like the stained glass. Let's move this a little closer to the camera. Sort of like, or not stained glass, but kind of the etched glass effect that, uh, these windows have nice de detailing on the undercarriage. There are two doors that open and close, one on each side. It's gonna pop those open. Uh, there are some seats. I don't know if you can see here, but there is a little bit of, uh, there's some detail inside, just some basic seats. This particular example is missing a couple things, namely, the brake wheels that would be right there uh, doesn't have either. Oh, my track is starting to come disconnected here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it's missing on that side. Plus, these are a little, just a little warped. There's some scuffing visible. If you look at the stills on the listing, you can see that. But uh, overall, pretty nice. Nice little unit. There's a scuff running along here, but if this is just running outside in your garden railway, I don't think you're going to notice too much. Real bright, cheerful colors. Again, like some cool detailing up here. These windows have a little bit of texture. Um, you can see the length here. So this guy is approximately 20 inches in length, maybe a little bit over 20, counting the couplers. Again, really nice model. Let's look at the undercarriage. It's got these big, I don't know if these are just like nickel, silver, or just some kind of steel plated, but uh, some really nice wheels, rolls really smoothly. This is the battery box. Uh, you put a nine volt battery in there to power the lights, switch, on off switches right there. Some more kind of cool detailing under there. See the Bachman brand. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Uh, I ran this train as part of the big hauler set that, oh, let's flip this guy off. As part of the big hauler set, it came in and ran fine. Um, man, these things are such a joy to uh, put back on the track. They're so big, they go on very easily. All right, so overall, this is a pretty nice model. I think it'd look great on any G-scale layout. It's kind of got a fun, old-timey look. And uh, that road name, that Chattanooga Railroad road name, probably uh, makes some grown-ups smile. All right, thanks for watching. If you found this information useful or helpful, please like and subscribe. Thanks again.